There is one person in the community of Toowoomba right now who has tested positive to COVID-19. I want to make it very clear that that person has followed all necessary protocols on the journey to get here to Toowoomba. Uh, given that he is in the, from the diplomatic corps, their protocols are different to other people. And that's the first learning from what's happened. Anyone who's in the diplomatic corps who is subject to those conditions ought to be subject to the same conditions that you and I be, would be subject to had we gone on the same journey. And this is causing significant concern for our community. Uh, but we need to focus on the facts and they are first and foremost, as advised by uh, Darling Downs Health, uh, this person is in isolation. Uh, there is uh, very little risk of uh, spread of COVID-19 uh, from this person, so everything's happening uh, as it should happen with them at the moment. So the health authorities are very confident about that. I think uh, what we've learned in this instance is that this person under guidance from local health authorities is doing exactly what they, are, they should do. Uh, there are symptoms, they're in isolation, uh, under observation from local health authorities. And so too does the responsibility remain with the rest of us throughout this pandemic crisis. Social distancing, washing our hands. We know elsewhere in the country, in Victoria in particular, people are being asked to wear masks in public. So uh, we shouldn't take this for granted. It's as serious as, uh, as it is, uh, has been throughout the year as it is right now. So we do need to maintain our local discipline and that, that's a responsibility of each and every one of us.